Pokimane, a huge, uh, not a huge. Pokimane, a Twitch streamer I'm sure you know either for her good looks or her annoying voice. I mean, personally, I've never seen the hoe. I mean, the girl. Jesus. <laughs> but <laughs> she's definitely not a hoe. Or is she? We'll find out, ladies and gentlemen. We'll find out. But she is a streamer who is quite, to be honest, the most annoying human being I have ever had to endure, listen to. I've never watched her live. So how do you say this? She's always on my timeline. Man. Everything she does just needs to get tweeted and put out there into the stratosphere. Or the stratosphere, is that a word? I'm saying it's a word, it's my word. Guess what? She's filled with drama, 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 even more drama. Firstly, I found this video of her online. It's a great video. Today, I just want to watch the video with you. Uh, apologies, there is some extreme profanity in it. I'm Volker, man. Some bad lingo, some bad language. If you are a person who is not white. What? And is a man of blair then please avert your eyes lad if you're easily offended because this is disgraceful i'm not even sure how she's not in prison had her mouth sewn up like deadpool in that crap wolverine film i actually used to really like that but anyway it's not important just watch this video it's her, her apology and then what she says in the clip from about seven years ago and although i never said it with ill intent or racial context or the hard r i still want to make it clear that i don't condone the use of that language Firstly, this is a terrible start. She's already, like, making excuses. Like, you know, if you're gonna be a man, or a woman in her case, and apologise for basically saying the end bob you gotta grab it by the balls, you know what I mean? Firstly, don't say it. It's a bad word. In my opinion, no one should say that. Whether you're white, black, this word should just be dead. It should be buried a long time ago. However, if you're a pasty white girl with Pokemon in her name, you extremely should not be saying it. You ain't funny. That's not true. Maybe you're just boring as fuck. Nigga, you ain't funny. Nigga, you nigga, nigga. Now, firstly, for the quality, this is not my video, but I just could not find it anywhere. The guy who uploaded it clearly just is having a wank at the same time as she says that I I just don't know why he keeps doing this. But the whole video is her just saying that um, I'm not going to replay it anymore. I think it's a bad word. Boo, boo, bad word, bad word alert. Boo, boo, boo. I'm not PewDiePie. I'm not crossing the bridge. What a fucking n But just like all great content creators, it seems, I've been able to find a sports heater, a page of five controversies from Pokimane. We're going to read them. You know, people seem to have forgotten. She's not a good girl. Not in one, not two, but five controversies. How many controversies have I had? Too many to count. <laughs> maybe, maybe one. Maybe one. OTV drama. She, uh, goes, oh, she was basically part of a gang, a group of mercenaries by the sound of it. And one of them was accused of sexual harassment. Okay, that's boring. Boyfriend drama. Boyfriend drama? She doesn't have a fucking boyfriend. I'm a boyfriend. Sleeping with the enemy. Uh, she attempted to boyfriends by letting them send boyfriend applications to sending massive amounts of money. What the hell? This lady started OnlyFans for OnlyFans was a thing. What the fuck? <laughs> this girl, I bet she's got stocks in OnlyFans, but she just hasn't made it available and clear to everyone. <laughs> oh yeah, DMC takedown. She basically, uh, she streamed, I think it was like Avatar or something funny. See, this girl, I think she just thinks she like rules the world. She rules the universe or something like that. She is so self-entitled and a little whiny little girl. She reminds me of like that blonde girl in uh, Mean Girls, you know, like one who has the party or whatever, and she's so self-entitled. She's like, no, mommy, I am the one. I am the king. I am the castle. She thinks because she's got breasts and she's the queen of Twitch, she can do what she wants. I hate that shit. All right. <laughs> Fuck off. Are my lines good enough? Fuck off. Is this real? Yo, the, the, that's not real. The girl's never sniffed a drug in her life. <laughs> so it might not be real. She said it was sugar. But I, you know, that sounds to me like someone who was trying to be famous and get clicks and get views and then decided actually this is a bad idea now that she realises lots of people look up to her. And obviously we've had the N-word. Um, it's kind of weird how people have forgotten about the N-word. I didn't actually know about the N-word until I wanted to, um, you know, make a video on her and ruin her day. After this video, by the way, I want you to comment how much you agree with me. We're starting a war, baby. This is like World War Two, but on an even, even larger scale. This is like World War Three. This is like World War Universe. Oof. You know what I mean? Does that make sense? Cool. Because we are going at it. I'm clearly the bigger channel here, so we, we've got the people, we've got the support. This bumps all round, we're going to win. But I realise I've wasted so much of your time, haven't I? I've not even told you what the main conversation is, and we're like five minutes into the video. So, <coughs> in my Pokemon, it's finally here! Introducing my new company, Minor Snacks! I can never find the perfect healthy snack that tasted good, but I made one for us. <coughs> 
I'm gonna make so much money off of you scumbags. The midnight mini cookies are made with real non g g gmo gmo. What does gmo mean? Non homo? She's so rude. Ingredients and added vitamin D. She's added vitamin D. D Ugh. What? It's like my dog shut on a plate. What is that? Are you telling me people are gonna buy that? Eight grams of sugar. <laughs> That means they taste like dog shit, alright? I'm not being funny. Health is wealth, I get it. But anything with less sugar in usually does not taste better. 140 calories. Is that per one? Per serving? This is like a little scam as well. Per serving? It'll be per serving and one serving is one little cookie. It's absolute garbage. Net carbs, 16 Gs. So, look, I, I think this is very misleading already. What a scumbag. I hate when companies do this. They don't make it clear at the bottom. Per serving. So, basically, a serving could literally be one cookie. We need to find out how much is one serving. Yes, oh my god, I can't wait for you to try it. Oh my god! Got a bitch! They're not good. They're gonna taste like utter butt cracks. Sounds tasty. Two years in the making to make a cookie. You're joking. You wanted to make an industrial level snack. I'm going to make my own snacks, guys. I want you to leave a like and leave a comment. Would you buy Haz's Mem Sweeties? They're going to be sugary as fuck. They're going to have so much caffeine in. They send you off your absolute doodles. And there's going to be a secret ingredient. My pubic hair. If you like the sound of that, please, please like and subscribe. And you can be the first. I'll send it to you for free. All we got to do is beat Pokimane in this war that I'm starting. I know what you're thinking. War is bad. Don't start wars. Be a good guy. I don't give a fuck, bitch. I'm about to start this shit. And I'm about to, I was about to say, I'm going to do a goddamn Oppenheimer. If you've seen the film, you know what I mean. Can I say that? Absolutely not. I don't mean that rudely. Ignore that. I'm not doing an Oppenheimer. What I meant is I'm going to blow this bitch sky high. That's even worse. So, what's the controversy? So, here's her snacks. She has basically copied these cookies right here called Totsy Midnight Mini Cookies. What were they called? Even the same nutritional facts. So, about four, seven cookies is one serving. Okay, that's slightly more acceptable than I think. Midnight Mini Cookies. Midnight Mini Cookies. Deep chocolate. <laughs> Deep chocolate. Velvet white chips. White drops. You know, same thing practically. She fucking copied it. What did Killer Cumstar say? Look, they are literally the same shabiz. Just to clarify, she did actually rebrand them as it says in the post. I just didn't feel like saying it at the time for some stupid ass reason. I don't give a fuck that she's copied them because I expect nothing less from Pokimane. She is just a literal illiterate. <laughs> so she buys the company, rebrands, relaunches, raises the prices, grifters gonna grift. This girl is basically just gonna rob her fans. All the 12 year olds that follow her and like the way she looks. And don't get me wrong, I'm a male. It's struggled to start a war knowing I have to decimate this one, but I will not stand for it. $30 for shit cookies. Look, if you like this video, I'm going to do a cookie review if I can get them in my country. Usually shit, I can never find this sort of stuff. If you want to see a review of minor snacks, because minor snacks are going to be minor. Peter, just stop talking. Dime. That's right, bitches. I've destroyed this, decimated this woman with one sentence. These hoes ain't loyal is a song from my childhood. These hoes ain't they don't give a fuck about the fans. They're screwing over their fans. They're ruining them. All this stuff is going to be an absolute rip-off. It's not going to be as good as you think. It's a brand that she's basically just bought and shafted her bright little colours over, added an orange dude, and turned him into little crap patties. It looks like a cow field on laxatives has shat on the plate, all right? It's a disgrace. Yeah, they call me rabbit. This is a turtle race. If you like my rhymes, if you like my chimes, please do leave a like and subscribe. I'm going to keep rhyming because I'm always vibing. Pokemon's life is going to be ruined because I am such a druid. <laughs> Eminem's got nothing on me. I apologise. This video was very coherent and made sense. Look, she just posts selfies. Ooh, control yourself, Harrison. You're starting a war. Look, I'll be honest, though. She wants, like, to, you know, speak to me or at least uh, acknowledge me. I, I would um, kind of really appreciate that. You know what I mean? I'm kind of lonely. <laughs> Look at that. My platform lets me get away with anything, starter pack. That's <laughs> so true. I love that meme. I love... How'd she got more likes? Seriously, guys. This is a huge start. And I am plan on doing it. She is a copycat. She's going to try and mug off her, frat, her fans and get them all to spend loads of money on shit that they don't need. It's manipulation at its finest. It's like... Oh, I can't say that. But it's like what you know it's like. It's the worst type of manipulation. Fuck her. Literally. <clears throat> no. Seriously, though, I am so done 
with content creators like this. We are creating a new wave, boys and girls. If you want to be a part of it, subscribe, like, comment, because I am going to be different. I will put all the sugar in the sweets, and I will give them to you, not for free, but for market value. I'm not going to mug you off, even when I get t-shirts, because get, guess what? Has his Mem t-shirts are coming out. I'm getting a Has his Mem t-shirt, all right? You can have one too. It won't be a rip-off, because I want people to wear them everywhere. I did business at GCSE level, and I understand lower prices, higher value, all right? Low prices, get shit done. See, I don't understand business, what am I on about? Right, that's it. Goodbye. I'm talking waffle. Subscribe, like, I want the t-shirts, don't you? Let's get the t-shirts.